Well, I see you only have your bachelor's degree. Are you planning to get your master's? Yes, sir. Drop. As soon as I can. Well, we don't require it for entry level. Drop. Drop. But if you're serious I'm very about... serious. I want to make teaching my life. Drop. I make these noises because I have Tourette syndrome. I'd like to tell you about it. It's a brain thing that causes me to make these strange noises. They're like sneezes. I know you think you're the class clown, but I've had it with you. Talking like a dog, for goodness sake. You can't help. Talk to your mom about it. She said, I said, stop it! Stop it! I couldn't really blame dad for losing it. My tics drove him nuts. I'm sorry, but how can you expect kids to learn when you're doing that all the time? You know, there are other things besides teaching. Not for me. I just don't see how you could ever teach a class. You want to teach here, you're going to have to refrain from making these noises in class. That is their failure, not yours. Well, it sure seems like my failure. What do you think is the most important thing you have to teach? I'm going to have to ask you to stop making those noises. Look, pal, he's not doing it. No, 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 I can handle it, Jeff. I got it. That it's okay to be yourself. It's okay to color outside the lines if that's who you are. You must be Brad. I don't want to hurt her, Mom. You've never been able to accept it. I just feel so helpless. The one thing I could never fix is the one thing that was hurting you most. It doesn't need fixing. Well, do you like making noises and upsetting people, Brad? No, sir. What can we do to help you, Brad? I just want to be treated like everybody else. The toughest and, and most dedicated teacher I have ever had. My constant companion, my Tourette's.